Hey folks. Hello again. We're we back. back at it again. Yeah. Holla at us, you know. Mm-hmm. Yeah, you know. Mm -hmm. It's been crazy, you know. Yep. Homie got the person calling extra. I don't know what the hell that is right now. <laughs> you no. Know but, but yo, <laughs> check this out. This is Ryan with NASA Bricks with all boogie. We back at it again. Yeah. Yo. Sorry, y'all. Um Monday. It was busy. Yeah. It was Labor Day weekend. So we yes. couldn't really shoot. The, right. Um, you got to put that. You, yeah. You got to put that on. No volume. Silence. Yeah. Yes. So, so we was out busy, mm -hmm. you know, busy. So yep. I was out, you know, mm -hmm. at a, you know, a day in Brooklyn Bridge Park, you know, mm -hmm. enjoying the sights. Yes. But yeah, you know, but. Today we're gonna talk about hmm. What are we gonna tell you we're gonna talk about? You know what we're gonna talk about? What we gonna talk about? What to say if if you know if you meet if you dealing with a person and you just want entanglements instead of something something you know, real. Something real so I'm gonna tell you the first thing. Mm -hmm. You're going to tell them. This is how you're going to say it to them. Okay. You're going to say it to them like this. Listen. Because you want a real relationship. You want something real. So you got to tell them. Look, right now, I can't give you what you want right now. Mm -hmm. And I can't give you that long-term entanglement mm -hmm. that you need right now in your life. You know? And it will be toxic for the both of us. Mm -hmm. Because... You know, you want the long-term entanglement, and I want a relationship. So, Basically. you got to tell them, I, I can't give that to you. Right now, you know, I got a lot of stuff going on. A lot of things I'm working on, mm -hmm. you know. It'd be cool and stuff, but right now I got a lot of things going on. And it's right now, you know, for something serious, like a long-term Entanglement. Mm -hmm. I can't deal with a long-term serious entanglement. Personally, I can't do that. Neither can I. So you know, that's how you gotta say it. You gotta tell them, like, look, look, listen. Yeah. yeah you want yeah. long-term entanglement? You do. Yo, know? and I can't give that to you right now. Right. You know, and mm -hmm. maybe you know. You no, know, I'll let you know someone there's gonna be someone out there for you that can give you that long term entanglement, mm -hmm. that serious long term entanglement yeah. that you need. Yeah. You know? And I can't get that to you right now. Mm hmm And it and it hurts because, you know, I ain't wanna break it down to you like that. Mm-hmm. But that's how it goes, you know. Pretty much. I mean How do you feel? Well the thing what is happened this... when I, cause I know a guy came to you and he was probably like, yo, he want a long term entanglement and he wanted to make it a long term marriage entanglement with well, you what did you I'm not him? built for that so and I let them know I'm not built for, for that at all we're obviously looking for two different things and um, I think you you know I let them know that they need to find that right partner because I'm not that partner yeah I just for me I don't even like entanglements because they lead to nowhere at the end of the day. And, you know, it's just one of those things. I I like something that's a little that's a little more permanent. Mm -hmm. I like something that that's more promising that's going to that's going to lead to something, you know? Yeah. I don't want something that okay, you know, um we kind of meet up and we just Mm -hmm. We have fun and mm -hmm. all that good stuff. And then we go on about our business until we meet again. It's like, what is the purpose behind that? Like, that's like a fake relationship to me. Or more like a, a quote unquote understanding type of deal. I don't have time for that. Yeah. I don't, I, 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 I you know. I, I'm I'm so past that stage in my life. I just can't. Yeah, I, I'm like, no, I don't do man. I don't do entanglements, and um, 
you know, I, I let men know that up front. The ones that aren't afraid to talk to me. And, you know, I don't do entanglements. Yeah. If that's what you want, I think that that's what you should, should go after. I, I, you know, yeah, I'm you all know. for that. You know, I'm not saying that, you know, it's a bad thing. Entanglements work for certain people. Yeah, I just, I'm just not one shit, of them. I know. I know a couple people that have been in long term entanglements and it worked beautifully for them. Yes. But me, I know it's very toxic. Right. And I have to tell the person I can't do that serious entanglement relationship. Right. I can't. Right. That serious entanglement relationship mm-hmm. is too much. It will be toxic. For yes. Me. Right. No. So you got to know you got to know where you're at in life. You got to know mm-hmm. whether something like this will work for you or it doesn't. You know, you just got to know. You know what I mean? Yep. And don't waste a person's time if you know that 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 works just for you. Yeah. And don't expect the person that you're dealing with is going to be okay with that. Let them know up front. Like and when I say up front, I mean before the second or third date. Let's 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 just be real about it, you know. Yep. Mm-hmm. Let's be adults. Let's, you know. But a lot of I know a lot of people will disagree with me, especially women, us women, because they'll say, "Well, if we let them know that, we won't get what we want." Well, that may be true, but then at the end of the day, it you can get whatever you it's want. You can lie. provide it. <laughs> It's for yourself lie, and guy... that too you know because the thing is this you know it's never a good idea to waste somebody's time because if you don't want your time wasted then don't waste somebody else's time mm-hmm. at the end of the day we're all you know human beings we all mm-hmm. have feelings we all have things that we want to do in our lives mm-hmm. and it's 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 about being human mm-hmm. it's about being real being mm-hmm. honest Mm-hmm. Say what you mean, mean what you say, you mm-hmm. know. But this thing about oh, I'm not gonna get what I want if I'm honest. Yeah, you are. <laughs> it just depends on it just depends on what that person's looking for. Yeah. If that person's looking for the same thing you're looking for, then mm-hmm. that's a match. Yeah. And you're gonna get <laughs> you know, it. I mean, it is what it is. You not you didn't get it from the other guy, right? And now you lying. And after when the guy wants some more, then mm-hmm. you just start being like, whoa, whoa, whoa wait a minute. Uh, No, that's not right. Right. I mean, the thing is this. Like I said, the whole idea of the entanglement is not a bad thing. It's just that it's not for everybody. Yeah. You know, if it's for you, fine. Just make sure the person you're dealing with is okay with it also. That's all I'm saying. And y'all could be one big, happy, entangled couple. Entanglement couple. That's all. Yep. Mm Mm-hmm. Facts. But yeah, folks. You checking some lady out? You're so funny. What? <laughs> Holy see, see, this, see, this is Joe, folks. Folks, see, see what she doing? You see what she doing? You see what she doing? <laughs> but you're so obvious with it. How I'm obvious? Cause, Cause I was, I was looking. Yeah, I'm a, I'm a man. I'm That's right. To, yeah, I'm not ashamed about it. Why? <laughs> Why? All right. Like I was saying, man. Um, I love it. Today, right? Mm-hmm. There was something about your boy Takashi. Six man. He was begging different media outlets like the Joe Button Podcast, the Gilly mm-hmm. the Kid Podcast, and Wayne O. Shout out to all of them. Um, right. That said decline to him for his interview, his he said his greatest interview ever that he'll that he'll that he'll say everything the truth and, oh, and exclusive. like he was in court like saying remember like in court when mm-hmm. they put up their hands yes. and say nothing but the truth he was Stop. ready to tell everything Stop. tell things that, he, that that no one never heard oh he was he was gonna give them an exclusive yes oh my yes that's deep uh-huh. that's deep Shh. word <laughs> <laughs> they said I love it but they was like no 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 I love it I and he wanted it. a cosign and they was looking at him like get the hell out of here with this cosign <laughs> well I ain't cosigning that shit <laughs> <laughs> oh you want to snitch out. so but you know what who did an interview when I was watching it who the shade room oh 
Yes. Whoa. The shade room. Shout out to the shade room, though. But yeah, but any it, the shade room did. Whoa. So. Hence they, the, the term shade room. I got you. Yeah, on IG and then on YouTube. Check mm-hmm. out that interview. Yeah. Mm-hmm. But he was professing like, oh, yeah. He was like, yeah, you know, they, you know, the guy shoddy that's currently locked up right now. Um, that he, that was one of the dudes he snitched on. Mm-hmm. But yeah, um, yeah, that he was trying to take his baby mother, and they was oh, having God. conversations with each other, and he found that in the phone when he took her phone, <laughs> and things of that nature. Oh no wonder he snitched on him. And plus, they was trying to get him. So that's why he had to rat. Uh-uh. Rat tat 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 on them. Let me say it again. Rat tat 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 on them. So. So instead of him. So let me understand you now. So instead of him just moving on like normal people do. He called himself avenging himself, if you will, by snitching on this gentleman. Snitch on a couple gentlemen. Interesting. Not just one. Okay. It's a couple. Okay, and were those gentlemen mm. plotting with the baby mama? The well? baby mother was plotting with them gentlemen that he was with, so called peoples that he was running with, mm-hmm. bloods that he was mm. running with, gangsters, goonies. Mm-hmm. Was running with, they was planning to get him. Oh. So he said he had to snitch. <sighs> okay. And then he said also his new girlfriend. He was. He oh, was he did like, get the new girlfriend. He, he did. He did. He did. He um, had a new girlfriend. He had a new wild way. Oh, the baby moms. so now the plot thickens, ladies and gentlemen. He got the baby moms with the new girl, and he asked his new girl. Do you think these guys are, are good? Like, they wanted to know. And then the girl was like, no, I don't trust you. They're jealous of you. Oh, God, help. <sighs> and this, this is just crazy. My thing, kids, folks, don't join a gang. Don't these do These kids, 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 listen, listen. Let me tell you something. These gangs don't love you. These gangs are not your family. They'll use yep. you and abuse you, uh-huh. and you'll be end up in a cell with Big Bubba. Uh uh-uh. uh, why you gotta talk about Big Bubba? Big Bubba, I. Big Bubba, man, he run the cell. Leave Big Bubba alone. And he's gonna want his ramen noodles too. And his tuna fish. And his Oreos. Yeah, he's gonna want his cookies too. <laughs> and if you have cookies, he's gonna want cookies too. That's right. And if you play around, he's going to smack you and make you not sleep at night. Okay, his other man's beat you up. That's right. If you don't play to his rules. That's right. And plus the CEOs. Because the CEOs don't like you anyway. Pretty so that's much. another thing you have to deal with. When yep. you In that predicament. Capacity. Predicament, so kids, you will. stay in school. Yes, please do. Don't join no gang. Get your LLC. Yep. Get some stocks. Yep. And start a business. That's right. Please, kids. At home. Really? Mm-hmm. Do that. And While you're on hiatus. Yeah. Like the rest of us. Yes. Mm-hmm. But yeah. Um, what else we had to say? Oh, the battle of the century. What? Oh, you know, I'm so ready for it. Oh, this was funny. The meme was funny. Mm-hmm. This is on Sunday. Mm-hmm. It can't be no, it can't be no, no Domino's pizza. It got to be Sunday dinner. Oh, you know it. It got to be Sunday. It got to be the grits, yes. the cornbread, All the ham, the chicken. Are you putting your order in, sir? Sure, it got to be some soul food from Big Mama. Remember Big Mama? Remember soul food? Yes. Mama, look. You know what I'm saying? It got to be like that. When Gladys Knight and they battle, and Patty, and Patty Auntie when, Patty and Auntie Gladys, baby, we when they so battle, you, you got you got you got to play that song, my mind, with with the soul food. Yes, sir. you got you got to do that. You got 
You gotta do that. How much? <laughs> you know? And you gotta have your plate and take your picture with the plate with a couple family members sitting with the family picture with with the with the um with the potato salad and everything. You are funny as hell. Yup. <laughs> mm-hmm. Yup. Gotta take that potato salad, some some collard greens, mm mm mm, extra gravy sauce too with that with the chicken, mm mm mm, mm mm mm, with the stuffing, mm, with the chicken. That Sunday dinner better be slamming when that come on, cause you know, and you can't be late either. Oh, why are you looking at me for? Because you are scaring me. I'm scaring you because I said they need to cook Sunday dinner. They had a plate ready. Okay. Okay. Yes, obviously my, 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 my co-host here is putting orders as well on the low. You know, I'm just putting it out there for him because he, he is scary right about now. But, um, yes. Yes, he wants a woman that knows how to cook. Oh, baby girl, baby girl. Me, 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 the oxtail and, and rice and peas, okay? And fried chicken. Put mm, the fried chicken yeah, in Yeah, fried chicken, nice. Yeah, man. Use olive oil, so don't use no corn. Use olive oil. It's mm -hmm. better, you know? Thank you. Mm -hmm. Oh, you gotta use the corn. The best, the, the best oil to fry chicken in uh, 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 is, uh, <laughs> you funny. Uh oh, you gotta put it, we got it right here. She gonna tell you, men, men, men. She'll cook you up a meal. It's, better stop playing. Oil, she better cook sir. you. She 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 gonna cook you up a meal, that's, fellas. That's the stop best playing, oil. fellas. Come right. She gonna cook you up that meal, man. Yes, I am. She gonna cook you up a nice meal. Mm, better stop I playing. Sure am. I will fatten you up. Don't play. Uh uh. Say she have your belly fat. That's it. And just watch out for the cat when you walk in the house. But anyway, like I said, <laughs> get out of control. <laughs> My cat is good. She she lo she loves people usually. <laughs>